mistake! Rookie mistake! Alright, everyone knows fashion is subjective, so you know, you can't really judge people on what they wear slash, you know, style. However, if you make these fashion mistakes, there is no turning back. Don't call me. Don't come by my house. We're done. Yeah, you have literally signed your death warrant and your credibility will be tarnished forever. Fool this man! So within this video, I'm going to be telling you what fashion mistakes you shouldn't be making and yeah, let's get into this. Alright, so the first fashion mistake you cannot make or else you are a complete donut is logo happy or wearing similar brands, yeah? So what I mean by this is a guy that just wears logos on top of logos on top of logos, looking like a walking billboard. Mate, you're just giving the brand free promotion and it just looks awful don't do it and also similar brands yeah this actually triggers me differently have you ever seen someone wear adidas joggers with nike shoes it just don't go well and it just jars me a little bit Rookie mistake. Rookie mistake. or even say if someone's wearing i don't know like a fendi jacket obviously the all over print and then they've got a gucci bag with the all over print and then they've got a hat which is burberry it's got the burberry print like yeah just just so many just logos and so many different similar brands and yeah it's just actually jars me you don't have drip you have a mental condition and you need to go to the hospital immediately if someone says something horrible to harvey what does harvey say hello you can obviously with designer you can sort of get away with it if you've got like a moncler on and then you've got i don't know like a louis vuitton hat fair enough yeah but i'm talking about if you just overdo it and you know it's just yeah just too much in your face and yeah just relax with all that an unironed t-shirt an unironed t-shirt <laughs> Yeah, I cannot stress this enough, yeah. Fair enough if you're just, you know, going for a jog or, you know, you're lounging about. Don't iron your t-shirt in it. But say if you're going out, yeah, and you want to look presentable and your outfit looks crazy, you've got the Jordan 4s on or whatever, and you've got your t-shirt all creased up, it don't look good. This ain't it, chief! That's what I would have told you! Okay, number three, a V-neck. Oh my god! Oh my god, V-necks actually tweak me differently. I might have no swagger when I'm fat, but at least I ain't wearing a fucking V-neck. Anyone can kiss my shirt like I would get embarrassed. Bruh, you actually have to have a neck to wear this. <laughs> No one wants to see your dusty ass chest hair. And even if you go to the gym and you've got a good chest and that, don't wear a v-neck. You look fruity as fuck. Ha! <laughs> Gay! This ain't 2011 anymore, mate. You know, get up with the times. Alright, the next one is black socks with white shoes. Or even white socks with black shoes. You fucking nonce! <laughs> It's just a lot of colour contrast and it just don't look well and, you know, very noticeable as well and, yeah, I just don't rate it. I understand if the socks got, like, a crazy design on it and you want to, you know, showcase the socks, fair enough, do your thing. But if it's just one colourway and it's a complete opposite colourway to your actual shoe, big mistake, big mistake. Rookie mistake! Rookie mistake! Alright, now the next one, too many patterns. I like patterns just as much as the next guy, but you won't see me having four different patterns on one one outfit. You know, you wouldn't have like camo trousers on with a flannel shirt, then you're wearing a bag that's got the Louis Vuitton pattern on it. It's just, yeah, it's just very in your face and they don't match. Even if it's the same color and all that, they just wouldn't match and, you know, too many patterns, too many contradictions, you know, just hurt my eyes and yeah, that is a big no-no. Also, skinny jeans. I'm not talking about, you know, them skinny jeans that are, you know, very wearable, you know, very breathable, let's say. I'm talking about the ones that sort of look like leggings, sort of look like, you know, spray-on jeans. That is a no-no, mate. Are you trying to cut off all circulation to your legs? I don't know how people can rock this. Fair enough if you're a female, but if you're a male and wearing this, you might as well call yourself a female, let's be honest. Oh my Say if you're in a situation, obviously you're at the bar or whatever, you're wearing these spray-on skinny jeans and a man wants to fight you. The other man has the advantage anyway because you're wearing skinny jeans. So you wouldn't be able to like navigate yourself around quick enough. And, and also there's a psychological advantage as well because if I saw a guy wearing skinny jeans, I know I can fuck him up differently. But anyway, those are the biggest fashion mistakes. I hope you did enjoy. If you did enjoy, please leave a like, a comment and also subscribe. Until next time, I'm out.